How's it going? This is Dylan with Dylan Pickups and Dylan Talks Tone. And we are like neck deep in our Ibanez Gem Floyd Rose project. We already put our Spurzel tuners on the guitar and now we've basically stripped off the stock parts. Um, obviously I figured I wouldn't bore you with those details, but basically we just removed the strings, removed the springs in the back and the stock tremolo comes right off. The main reason for this video today is I want to show you the whole reason why um, people think that these things are terrible. Um, and I'll show you a couple of things. Now mind you, I bought this guitar about two months before we shoot this video today. Probably got about 15 to 20 hours of play time. So not a lot over the you know, in the, in the grand scheme of things. So I really wanna just kinda of show you the advantage to upgrading to an actual Floyd Rose tremolo. Again, I'd like to thank uh, Floyd Rose Marketing for, for sending us this thing because it's really gonna make a big difference in the guitar and I'll show you why. Okay, we'll see if we can properly show you what we're talking about here. So we've got our stock um, Floyd Rose style tremolo, right? Uh, the Ibanez, edge, whatever incarnation it is. Now the main thing I want to show you here, let's see if we can see that, but see this very front edge? This is the pivot edge that the tremolo uses obviously to, to move on, right? And its ability to come back to center, uh, at least with the Floyd Rose, a lot of it has to do, or the Floyd Rose style double locking, is, has to do with this edge right here. And can you see in the video, this edge right here is already kind of getting chewed up. And if you look here, you can see that this is getting chewed up also. Uh, as, as soon as these start to deteriorate, these edges start to deteriorate, then it makes it very difficult for the tremolo to return to center. Um, and that is the main reason. And if we look at the studs that are used to put them in, uh, you know, to locate the height. You notice that it's like some sort of brass and you can see the wear already happening on these, uh, let's see if you can see that in there, on these studs. So if the studs themselves are wearing and the edge of the tremolo itself is wearing, then it'll make it very difficult for this thing to return to center. So that's probably, you know, one of the main reasons why it's good to change out this tremolo. Now, like I said, this guitar is only a couple of months old. It's only got not two dozen hours of play time on it and you're already being able to see the wear on the leading edge of the trim. I mean, um, that is where we get into just the superior metallurgy and parts of the Floyd Rose stuff. It's gonna be an excellent upgrade and uh, as we go ahead and put this thing together, we'll show you what we're talking about. Also, the other thing that makes a big difference is, uh, and we'll talk about this a lot because we got a bunch of stuff to test, is the mass of the, the block, the tremolo block. Uh, this is, uh, the stock one is a steel one. This is some sort of cast zinc. They're a completely different weight. The tremolos actually weigh differently too. Um, there's a different weight to them. And so just the overall quality of all the hardware and everything makes it to where it's gonna be more stable and it's gonna wear a lot longer. One thing I should mention, while we're talking about wear and the longevity of the tremolo, any uh, edge style tremolo like this, you should not adjust the string height of your guitar. We're gonna get into setup later, but we'll talk about this just briefly now. You should not adjust your string height with these nut nuts or these bolts with string tension and spring tension on the guitar. Uh, that can lead to premature wear of this edge right here. So if you have to move those, when we start talking about our setup, we're going to be slacking the tension on the strings in the back and uh, making it a little easier. So reason number one for doing an upgrade on your Floyd Rose style guitar is just the overall quality of the parts. My name is Dylan. This is Dylan Talks Tone, and we'll talk to you soon.